nice to be in a warm place. We're from Chicago. Thank you for having us out tonight. This next song is called Mirror, and uh, I don't know if you know it, those of you that do, you guys can sing along. That'd be awesome. We love having a choir whenever we can. But quite honestly, this song's my testimony, and I wanted to share that with you guys tonight. Because growing up, I struggled with eating disorders. Because I thought I had to look a certain way and be a certain way to be accepted in this life. And eating disorders led me to depression and so many other things. Just a bad path of life that I was on for a very long time. And after years of this struggle of thinking that it was okay to have these eating disorders and thinking it was okay to live a depressed life, I finally came to the end of myself and realized it was not a life I wanted to be living. And I finally fell to my knees. And in my brokenness, I cried out to God. And this is what I spoke. I said, God, I don't know if you're going to speak to me. I don't really know if you're real. I know religion, but I don't know anything about the true you. I need you to come and heal me. And I didn't expect an answer. I didn't really expect a response. But in that moment, I felt God speaking to my heart. And he said, Rebecca, I have made you in my image, in my image alone. You're not to be looking to the things of this world to define you. You're not to be looking to the images of this world to find your worth. You are destroying what I created to be lovely. And in that moment, I realized that if the creator of the universe was speaking to me something completely different than I've been living my whole life, that it was something that I needed to listen to. And he also impressed on my heart the verse Isaiah 62. And in that whole chapter, in, the, in verses 1 through 5, it talks about how God desires to change our name. How we view ourselves as desolate, forsaken, as broken. But it is God's desire to call us Hepzibah, which means my delight is in my child. My delight is in my chosen one. Now guys, we sing this song today. Oh, I didn't tell you the rest of my story. God healed me that day from eating disorders. take over my life. I had let eating disorders consume my mind because I didn't know otherwise. But guys, tonight, our challenge to you is take your thoughts captive. Take those things captive that are telling you that you're no good, that you can't fulfill your calling, that you're not called, that you're not good enough to follow God. Throw those things aside. God wants you, every piece of you. He doesn't care if you're broken. He wants He wants a broken people. He wants his broken people. He wants to change your name and to view you differently and for you to view yourself in a different way. So this is called Mirror and this song is based out of speaking against those thoughts and saying, no, I will not believe these thoughts anymore. I'm going to believe what God is speaking to me. This is me. 